but it's the routine. That's what you were saying. Yeah. Like, it all kind of comes down, you know, to to that to that routine of taking care of yourself yes. and and finding those moments where you can be mindful and kind of reset, you know, and, yeah. and, and that's important to cover, to kind of just cover everything we have, because I know we're getting towards the tail end of our conversation, but you know, if, if your tank ain't full, trust me, there's no way you're going to be yeah. able to consistently maintain a safe place to express your emotions. hundred percent. And the, uh, let me just add yeah. one little other nugget that has been so uh, appreciated by friends of mine that I've shared it with along the way. We, we tend to uh, stereotypically or socially place a real value on having dinner as a family each night. Mm -hmm. My wife and I have found such value in having dinner after the kids go to bed on certain nights. Oh, I love that. Right? Great, so yeah. every, yeah. every Friday night we have martinis and, and homemade pizza. Mm -hmm. uh, right. So that, that night is always after the kids, but then typically one or two other nights during the week, um, you know, typically weekends we're eating as a family and, and, uh, you know, most days we're eating as a family, but those times where just she and I can connect, um, you know, and whether we're, um, you know, having a, a chat at the table or whether we're watching a show together or what, whatever it is, but we're spending time together without the, the these little stressors yes. <laughs> hanging out with us, which we, you know, we of course love the days that we have breakfast as a family and we have this, you know, nice little safe place that we can talk about anything in the cone of trust and all that kind of good stuff. But, <laughs> you know, to be able to, to exercise that time together to make sure that we then fill our, our love tanks, right. From, yes. With one another. Uh, right. If, if we're not on the same page and we're not feeling those happy, happy feelings, pretty hard to, uh, you know, display that for our kids and, and treat our 100%. kids. Really well. well, it comes down to routine. I love the fact you brought that up because that's a wonderful hack.